Open your heart. Open your heart to me. Nope. My friend from the mess said that they're throwing a feast for the mysterious passenger. Apparently, hello, these are private quarters. Khan is my name. Your hair is so uncomplimentary. Excuse me? Did Khan do a thing of displeasure? I'm merely saying your hair should be soft, natural, simple. And you should be outside, clothed, showered. Seriously, you need a shower. You smell like a latrine. Khan does not smell. Oh, I grow fatigued. Ugh. Well, I didn't get a chance to go to dinner, but it pays to know someone in the mess. Look! Food capsules! Ah, you changed your hair for me. Excellent. No, I didn't. You did not? You know you can't just barge in here like that, right? You are not the historical woman. That's McGivers. You all look the same to me. Get out of my quarters! Go! Stay! But do it because it is what you wish to do! Drug made me spill my food capsules. Hey, look what my friend from the mess hall brought over. Seriously, nobody pays any attention to the wait staff on this ship. And Dorian Ale! Seriously, buddy, this is your last warning. What do you want of me? It's 100% clear. Leave. Your eyes betray you. I'm not even looking at you. Excellent. Excellent. I plan to take this ship as my own. That's it, I'm calling the captain. This gross tiresome. You must now ask to call the captain. I'm just gonna call him. You will not stop me. Ah, this door will not open. Do you want me to open that for you? No. I remain fatigued. I feel fatigued. No, only I grow fatigued. We are going to a desolate planet with no food, no water, and most likely death. Would you care to join us? Absolutely not. Perhaps you misunderstood my words. I said no food and no water. Go away. <sighs> I informed the captain that you have chosen to come with us. 